thank you for joining with me. I would like to lead you in a seven-day guide for uh, surrendering our lives in preparation for God to do a great and mighty revival within our lives, which will involve confession and repentance. If our prayers and witness are, are to have life-shaking power, God's saints must be deeply cleansed and filled with God's Spirit. Psalm 66 verse 18. To prepare for revival and spiritual awakening, I urge every believer to embrace the following journey to full surrender. As believers embrace times of cleansing, let us remember today and the days to follow three key truths. The first one is we are fully accepted in Christ's blood and righteousness. Let us keep our eyes on God's grace and not be defeated by condemnation. God convicts to transform, not to condemn His children. And number two, do not just confess sins, also forsake them. Proverbs 28 verse 13. Believe Christ to live through you. Ask Him to daily fill you with His powerful presence. You can now trust God to cleanse and empower for a dynamic prayer and witness. Now we'll begin our first day that will lead us to a time of surrender. Pure thoughts. For as he thinks in his heart, so he is. Proverbs 23, 7. Casting down arguments and every high thing that exalts itself against the knowledge of God. Bringing every thought into captivity to the obedience of Christ. 2 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 5. Today, please fully confess and forsake whatever sins God brings to mind. You must be honest. Trust God to fill and empower you with His Spirit. A few questions or a few thoughts. Do I have any pattern of unclean or lustful thoughts? Do I think far more about worldly things than spiritual? Am I often guilty of angry thoughts? Do I frequently entertain thoughts of doubt instead of trust? Am I often filled with thoughts of bitterness and unforgiveness? Well, believe Christ today to live through you by His Holy Spirit. Look at Romans 6, 11. Put off sinful thoughts and put on Christ by faith.